nursery. Hello reception. Today I'm going to share a story with you and it's about monsters. I know Mrs. Parr and Mrs. Poncia has already shared some fun monster stories with you and I'm sure you liked them. I think you'll like this one as well. But it's not just about monsters, it's about broccoli. It's a fun story though. And today I've brought Rory the Rainbow Monster. He's going to have a little listen to the story as well today. So get comfy and start listening. It's called Monsters Don't Eat Broccoli. The waitress in the restaurant just doesn't have a clue. Monsters don't eat broccoli. How could she think we do? We'd rather snack on tractors or a rocket ship or two, or tender trailer tidbits, or a wheelie steely stew. A wheelie stew? Oh, I don't think I'd want to eat that. Fum, fi, fo, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. Monsters don't eat broccoli or artichokes or greens. We can't abide alfalfa sprouts or slimy lima beans. They're really not interested in their greens and vegetables, are they? But redwoods are delectable. And boulders, what a treat. And a fountain is so refreshing in this dreadful summer heat. Foom, fi, 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 monsters don't eat broccoli. We're crazy for construction. And we crave our fish and chips. Fish and chips it normally is, isn't it? But monsters don't eat broccoli, it will not pass our lips. You cannot force us monsters to eat vegetables we hate. Let humans have the garden, we will eat the garden gate. <gasps> Eating the garden gate? Foom, fi, fo, fi, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. Monsters love a picnic on a blanket in the park with a clump of giant maples and their yummy, gummy bark. They're eating trees. Foom, fo, fi, fi, we're chomping down on broccoli. Say what? This isn't broccoli, it's crunchy munchy trees. And wow, are they, they are delicious. Another helping, please. Those cheeky monsters really didn't want to try that broccoli, did they? Can you remember a time when you didn't want to try something new? And then actually you found that when you did, you really, really liked it. It might be a fruit that you tried, or it could be a vegetable, or there might be something that you really haven't tried yet and you could be missing out on it. It could taste really nice. So maybe you could have a food adventure this week and think, right, I'm gonna try something new, just a little nibble and see if I like it. Or perhaps you might like to make a snack with your grown-up, get your grown-up to help you think about what's a healthy snack that you might like to make. Could you help chop some carrots up? Or could you make a little fruit salad that's nice and healthy? Maybe something for a monster that they might like to eat. Maybe not broccoli though. So have some fun this week and I'll see you soon.